Humans, but also robots, learn to improve their behavior. Without existing knowledge, learning either needs to be explorative and thus slow, or to be more efficient, it needs to rely on supervision, which may not always be available. However, once some knowledge base exists, a robot can make use of it to improve learning efficiency and speed. This happens to our children at the age of around three when they very quickly begin to assimilate new information by making guided guesses of how this fits their prior knowledge. This is a very efficient generative learning mechanism in the sense that the existing knowledge is generalized into as yet unexplored novel domains. So far generative learning has not been employed for robot and robot learning remains a slow and tedious process. The goal of the experience project is to devise a framework that will improve learning in robotics and can be applied at different levels of the robot's cognitive architecture. So we introduce the concept of structural bootstrapping. This is an idea taken from child language acquisition research to define generative mechanisms which use existing robot experience together with new observation to enrich the robot's knowledge with missing information about object, action, and planning entities. In this scenario, we use the example of rearranging the room, setting the table for two people, and preparing salad, and show that the robot can efficiently acquire new knowledge about planning operators, objects, and required actions by structural bootstrapping. A robot is preparing the salad together with a human and setting the table for dinner. How does the robot solve this task while replacing missing entities? Let's look at the situation in more detail. Mirko asks Arma to prepare a salad. For this, Arma first needs a salad bowl. Arma has already learned what a bowl looks like. It goes to the countertop and looks for a bowl. It does not see a standard salad bowl. But it has already learned that a bowl is something round into which something can be put. Arma looks for a suitable object and sees the mixing bowl. Then Mirko asks Arma to go for a can of corn for the salad. Arma does not know where the corn is and asks Mirko. Mirko tells Arma that the corn is in the fridge and Arma brings the corn. Arma can not only replace objects with others that have similar functionality. It can also propose alternatives based on previously learned knowledge. When the salad is ready, Mirko and Katja sit at the table and would like a soda. But Arma knows that there is no soda. Arma has learned that soda is a beverage. It knows other beverages and knows that there is fruit juice in the fridge. Consequently, Arma asks Mirko whether fruit juice would also be okay. When Mirko answers in the affirmative, Arma brings the fruit juice. Based on its experience, Arma was able to replace missing objects and infer common object locations to perform a task. In the same way, Arma is able to replace actions with semantically similar ones.